Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Lady Ball Show. I am your host, Veronica Charnel. And today, tonight, I should say, rather, <laughs> tonight, I'm going to be interviewing. Hello, everyone. I'm going to be interviewing another influential woman on the Lady Ball Show. So if you do not know me, I am your host and the creator of this show. I am Veronica Charnel. So I want to welcome everyone that's going to come into this particular broadcast. Um, I know some ladies are going to be coming in. They may be coming in late, but I want to welcome everyone ahead of time, even to the replay viewers, because this is possibly going to be also on um, other uh, social media platforms as well. So... Welcome to the Lady Boss Show tonight, everyone. I will be talking to a boss babe, an influential woman who believes in the power of setting goals. Um, and also she has podcasts and she has a playbook that will leave you desiring for more. So everyone, this is the Becoming Her series. Um, so I'm gonna be talking to basically to women. For those of you who do not know, um, what this is, this could be new to you. I'm going to be talking to women, chosen jewels, who are using their God given gifts to help transform the world and society. And of course, I've already stated I am your host and, and the creator of this show. And so I do see we have one viewer. We have one that has come in. I know some of the para girls are probably finishing up on their past the cast. They have, <laughs> they have the past the cast tonight. So I have one viewer, that's my mom. She's joining us. Thank you for joining, <laughs> for coming in, for supporting. Um, now listen, for those of you who are going to be coming in, I want you to share, if you would, share for me your, your city and what state that you're in before I bring on my guests, before I start talking to my guests. Those of you who I'm going to be highlighting on the screen to tell us your city and you know, state that you're joining us from. So that can be, so I can shout you out. So that can be featured. And you know what, Could you, you can also please share this broadcast to your community, to your, um, to your followers as well. I believe I share s some of it. I got, I'm, I'm gonna go back and share the other part too, um, into make sure I wanna be the first part taker into my group, the Essence of Diva Society group. I'm gonna make sure I share it there as well. And so, and I do see, okay, I do see some comment. Of course, you know, uh, Dr. Tammy, she is, um, she's, I would guess, but she's joining from Texas, all the way from Texas. So before, also before I get started, and my mom is joining us from North Carolina. <laughs> so this broadcast is being brought to you by our sponsor. We do have two sponsors. Um, the first sponsor would be from Dash of Sophistication Boutique. Um, that's my boutique is where we're coming live from. Um, you can also check us out on the, the, if you click shop, if you do click the, the shop link, um, within on the Facebook page, you will see the new products and jewelry, and we're now featuring clothing, um, that we are offering. So you could check us out on, um, Dash Sophistication Boutique. Also, we have Shawnell Healthcare Services is also one of our sponsors as well. Now, so let me go. I don't want to, I do. Okay. I don't see anyone else coming in just yet. If there's a delay, I do apologize. Um, but now I will guess, let me and bring my guests in. Our guest is the guest for tonight. She is an educator. She has a PhD. She has um, she has earned a right to be called doctor. <laughs> 
Um, she's a member of the, see, I don't discriminate. I don't discriminate. She's a member of the Zeta Phi Beta. Zeta, if I said it correctly, the Zeta Phi Beta sorority. She is an author of Manifesting More Playbook. And she is the host of her own podcast show called Journey for More, I believe. Or I want I want to say Journey for Manifesting for More, but I believe it's Journey for More, a <laughs> podcast. And that's available as on Apple's on like a, on, on basically all of the podcast platforms that is currently available. So the one I'm bring her in. So the one that I am referencing to. Uh, would be Dr. Tammy Francis Donaldson. So I'm going to bring her on. So you, everyone, let me, I got to bring, let me bring these down. So everyone will be able to see Dr. Tammy. Hello, Dr. Tammy. Hello, 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 hello. How are you? How's everyone today? I'm sure they, I haven't seen the comments are coming up. I do. She said that it's a, my mom said it's a pleasure to meet you. It's a pleasure to meet Dr. Tammy. <laughs> well, to, you know, I'm going to be asking you some questions. Don't be nervous. It's going to be laid back. It's going to be like a laid back, you know, thing. Um, as far as me, like asking you a few questions of, about you, you know, basically so that everyone could get to know who you are. I know you're members of the Perry Girl, but tell us a little bit about yourself. So, uh, hello everyone. How are you, Miss Bessie? Hi. I don't know what you heard about me, but <laughs> we'll talk <laughs> later. We'll talk offline. <laughs> <laughs> but everyone, I am Dr. Tammy. I am your life strategist, literacy educator, and I help you move in the direction of more and prepare for what's next. And you know, a little bit about me. I I'm from Texas. I'm a Texas girl, so you know, it's big or go home. So we just do it all. And I do it all. And so whatever it is, I do it. I'm sure it's going to come up. I'm not going to say much about me. I am a mother of two boys and I am an educator. This is going into year. I can't even remember. I don't even know if it's 18 or 19. I'm starting to lose count. Wow. <laughs> of teaching and being a teacher. And that's, and that's what I love to do. I love to teach. And so what I've recently decided to do, I guess in 2016 is expand my reach. And instead of just teaching my students each semester is take that beyond those walls and mm -hmm. turn it into a global classroom. So now that's what I'm doing. And I'm teaching the other things that are part of my passion and a part of my purpose here. And so that I think is here on earth. And so that's what I do now. And so I'm sure we'll get into some of that as we talk. So I'll let that unfold. But that's kind of where I am now. If you wonder how did I end up here? That's pretty much it. Okay. Now, what what grade do you teach? Are you like you're in college? You teach college level? I te okay. So I teach college now. I'm gonna see if I can get my head up on the screen. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, but I I teach college now. But I taught K twelve for ten years, and then I've been the last eight or nine. I've been teaching in higher ed, and so now I teach college students. And typically, there are freshmen. Um, is what I do most of the time. But sometimes I teach, you know, master's level and doctoral level students, but those who are going to be educators. And then um, I also teach those that are um, not yet college ready. And so mm -hmm. I help prepare them for college level classes and getting them. They're adults, they're in school, whether they're traditional freshmen or non-traditional students, they're in school. And so I teach a wide range. So, so I teach college now, although I have a special place in my heart for high school. Right. <laughs> right. That's what I wanted to do at first, but you never know which way the Lord may take you. I wanted to get um, my doctorate and be like in, in the business department, but it didn't, it didn't go that way. It didn't go. <laughs> way. You never but, know. It's never you too late know. and you never know. Yeah. Cause that, that would be my next step to go for like a doctorate or PhD, but uh, we'll see. Lord knows. We'll see. <laughs> And I do see, I want to stop for a moment. I see Grace has jumped on, um, joined the broadcast. Thank you, Grace, for coming in. Um, please share it out um, to your community. Thank you for supporting. I greatly appreciate it. Um, now, um, Dr. Tammy, oh, I'm, Grace, I know you're watching from, from Atlanta. I know you're watching from Georgia. Um, she is. She. I know she's from Georgia. <laughs> 
Great. And so, I'm coming to your neck of the woods soon. I'll be ooh. in Georgia in about a month. <laughs> oh, another you have another um, another engagement yeah. there. I do. Well, I, I'm going to a conference, but of course, it's always an engagement. So I'm also going to be meeting with some of my people in that area, some of my community in that area. So, so yeah, mm -hmm. that's good. Good. <laughs> um, get that out so people yeah. can come and check you out. Uh, well, let's let's talk about um, about your book, um, okay. Dr. Tammy. It's called a playbook. I noticed you called it. Yes. And it's I know you call it manifesting more playbook. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> I, I had to find a graphic or a picture of it. <laughs> um, I know you call it a playbook. Tell us, you know, a little bit about your vision. You know, when you decided. When you decide, say, I'm, I'm going to write this book, you know, your author has to decide what they're going to write. Right. You got to, you know, you got to structure it and bring it together. What what made you want to do uh, in this type of book, like a playbook? Oh, that's a good question. That's a very good question, Veronica, because my, if you, if you Google my name, my publications that come up all deal with education. I have several professional articles and journals published and chapters and books published, but it's dealing with education and technology and using technology in the classroom and stuff. And of course, best strategies for reading and writing. And so this one was, is, is quite different from my typical writing up until this point, I guess, because I, I'm always looking for the perfect planner. I'm always mm -hmm. looking for the perfect calendar. I'm always doing that. And I can't never find it because I find myself, I have a calendar, I have a journal, I have vision boards, I have all these things in all these places. And I thought it'd be so nice if I can get it in one place because I'm mm -hmm. always on the go. I'm always moving and I'm always shaking, moving and shaking. And so I thought, how can I get all these things in one? And so I started looking for calendars and probably two years before I actually started working on this one, I just got different calendars and tried them out and planners and planning systems and tried them out to see if they would work. And none of them fit my lifestyle. None of them fit what I wanted to do and how I wanted to organize my life. I wanted to see my vision, but I also wanted to goal set quarterly. And I wanted to each day plan out my day, you know, our typical to-do list. And I was thinking, what, why can't I find something that does everything? And some of them, they do have the capability. Don't get me wrong. There's some out there that do. But you have to buy all these pieces. And by the time right. you buy all these pieces, it's a 40 or $50 calendar. Then to buy all the pieces. By the time you get all the pieces you like in there, it's $200 that you've mm -hmm. spent before. And that's even with free shipping and all the good things that all the you know, the thing, all the offers that they offer, that's still like $200. And I'm saying this has to be a better way because my thing is it doesn't have to be fancy. It just has to have what, have what I need. And so I thought I'll just fix it. So I started creating it just for me and I started just using printed out copies and mm -hmm. I realized I really like this. And so what I decided to do, well, let me bound it and, and sell it. Like this is part of my system. And so, and before I did that, I got a little cold feet. So I sat on it. So it's actually been ready since last, since, no, now it's two years ago, 2017, December, 2017. And I sat on it a while because I was in the midst of my mastermind group and we were using the pieces of it and I was sharing it with them and we were using it and it was working for them, but I, I wasn't sure, you know, you do it and you think, well, this is works for me, but I don't know if it'll work for other people. Right. And so I thought, let me use it with them. And then when I used it with them, I was like, okay, this works. But then it took me a minute to just kind of catch my breath and say, mm -hmm. all right, now you're going to really do do the next step. Now you got to go for it. You know, it's that, you know, you, when your goals are big and they scare you, then you know you're on the right track. But it took me a minute. <laughs> it took me a minute right. to, mm -hmm. to get up the nerve to do it. And so finally in July, I had to publish. And let me tell y'all, like, even at that point, I sat on it. I didn't release it till November. But it was ready, bound, ready to go in July. I was ready to sell it. I had the pricing on it. I had it up. I was ready. I was ready mm -hmm. to distribute it. But I held on to it another three or four months. And it was November before I, I released it. I finally just said one day, I was like, I'm, stop, I'm not going to wait any longer. 
I'm going to release this and let's just see what happens. Those that need it can use it. And plus my groups can use it. So, you know, that's what right. we use in my, my membership group and my mastermind groups. That's what we mm -hmm. use. So I say, if nothing else, I know that we'll use it and it will, it, it makes it a lot easier than having all these pieces thrown at you. And so, yeah. So that's kind of so how what, it came to be. And now it's here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And it's pretty, it's a pretty big book. That is a book that, that would take the anyone who purchased it like for the whole year. I mean, what, what type of, what type of person can benefit from this book as far as what, what's your target audience? So really is anyone who wants to get their life in order, who wants okay. to get, to, you know, manage their time better and just get their life in order and really bring what they want into their life. So if there's something you desire and want that you bring that into your life. And so that's based on, so anyone, so I have, I'm, I plan to use it even with my students and show them how to organize their lives so they can manage their classes and things. Moms can use it. Entrepreneurs can use it because mm -hmm. it's customizable. Like you can customize it to your life. So I, I don't like those calendars. I don't know. Maybe I'm the only one, but if any of you have gotten those calendars where they have the dates already in there, and so if you get it in March, you can't use January, February. You just, mm -hmm. you just gotta wait. You just, it's a wasted thing. And so this one is where you can pick it up at any time and use it. And so um, I like that about it too. So it's, so anyone who wants to get their life in order and really want to plan and be purposeful and intentional about what they're doing and what they're accomplishing. Um, and so anyone who's, who's has goals. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. And we have to have, we have to have like, we have to have a mind to set goals because right. you're not, you're not going to accomplish anything if, if you don't have goals, right. you know, and then, you know, those who are viewing, feel free to comment. If you have any questions for Dr. Tammy, please put it in the comments. So we, you know, we'll try to get to it as well, either during the broadcast or during the live broadcast or even after. Um, so that that's good. Your playbook sounds good, Dr. Tammy, because it's something that they can use, like all, the, like you said, all the time, year round. Something that they can, because I know in the paragraphs we, we talk a lot about, we have to write down our goals. Mm -hmm. We have to write down. Like some of us are electronic, you know, like me, we, we use like a little the notepad on the phone, but it's necessary to kind of write it down, like the, like you know, write the vision and make it plain. Exactly. So I kind of I kind of see that's where you're going to, because so every, everyone, you know. They, if some people need that, so that that's that's good right there. Now your your tell us more about your book as far as where they can find your book, where they can purchase your book. And another thing, I before I tell you where you can purchase it, let me just say this just just to mm -hmm. comment on what you said. Yeah, some yeah. people talk about well because it's a hard copy, and everybody's asking, do you have a digital? And I made a hard copy intentional because there's something that clicks in your brain when you write things down. Even if you don't look at it every day or every moment, when you write it down, it just does something. There's We're not going to go into the science of the brain. We don't have time of that. But I won't get too technical. But there's just something that happens that it just clicks. And things and, and things are more real when you write it down. You're, mm -hmm. it, it becomes a reality. There's just something about when you're doing that motion and you're writing it down. So I encourage people to write down their goals. And by it, it covers all areas of your life and the different areas of your life, the whole you. And so you can get it on my website at tfdonaldson.com forward slash books. Um, if you want to go straight to the page, you can go to my website, tfdonaldson.com. But if you want to go straight to the page, it's books. You can also get it online at Amazon and Barnes and & Noble and purchase it directly from there, especially your Amazon Prime member with the free shipping and stuff. And sometimes, mm -hmm. you know, they, they have different things. I know Amazon does special things for their members. So if that's an account, you can get it there, too. But you can definitely um, get it at any of those places. And it's available now. It's available now for those who are interested in getting it as far as, you know, Dr. Tammy's book. Um, I, I'm, I'm, let me give you also space. I just remembered. Are you doing any type of special or giveaway that you would I like? I am. To I am. Because we're using it. A lot of people get it. You can get it. So the book you can purchase. And when you purchase it, you can get it. And you, you it's, it's self-explanatory. You can go through it. You can figure it out. But there are some people that like to know. Um, how each of the parts work together and how they use each part and really get it, use, utilize it to its utmost. 
And so I offer those that want to work more closely with me and how my vision for it and how it all works together and how it can really bring in what you want into mm -hmm. your life. Um, I have my membership group. And so my membership group is where we each week we we work through it and we plan and we do all that and we hold each other accountable. And so that group right now is on special at like 45 percent off. So that's a deal. So here's a deal. Right. This is the deal. And then. For those people on this broadcast who like, comment, and share this broadcast out to your family, friends, and someone's inbox, wherever, it doesn't have to be on your page if, if it doesn't fit your branding, but definitely share it with those that could benefit from it, then I'm going to draw on Saturday. So for 48 hours, this is going to be up and rolling where people can come in and watch the, via the replay. So my, our replay viewers, thank you for joining us. You get a chance to be in the drawing as well by liking, commenting, and sharing. And then on Saturday evening, I will pull all the names of those that commented, liked, and share. I'll vet everyone out. And then yes. we'll do drawing. And that drawing will be live on my page um, mm -hmm. on Tuesday. Maybe Tuesday. We'll see. Maybe Sunday. We'll see. I'll announce when the drawing's going to be. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so those of you who, so, who like and share and everything, comment, even the replay viewers, we understand that sometimes everybody can't come in and sit in it and watch it live. Um, that's one thing. Me and Dr. Tammy's in the same social media group. We un we fully understand that, but we know the power of replay, and we know the power of sharing. So we don't we don't get um, uptight or anything like that. We keep the ball rolling. We keep this thing moving. We that's that's just how it is. Yeah. You know you understand. You know that's just how how we how we roll. We roll. So, <laughs> That's just, you know, it's not like, it's not like, oh, I don't care. You know, you, you have to keep moving. You have to keep moving. You have, you have to keep going. And so anyone who has come in, if you have popped in to watch us live, thank you for, for coming in, you know, mention your city and state. Um, I'm using this particular app, this, this particular software. So if I, if I don't call your name out, you know, please forgive me. So a lot of times you have to comment or you have to share, then I can see it or some type of reaction, then I can see you. But everyone who comes in, who takes time to, to, to share and to like and to view this, I want to shout, shout you out. That's just how I, how I do. You know, it's always it's always good to do that and, and to engage your viewers and everything. So those who watch the replay, hey, we love replay viewers, you know, but I me, I don't want to get sidetracked. <laughs> Exactly, exactly, Dr. Tammy. I don't get sidetracked. So if you comment, um, I will basically, you know, highlight your comment. That's why I love to highlight the viewers' comments. That's why I love this particular software because it's so neat. I just, it's easy and it's easy to use. Um, and make sure you share this to your community, to your community and to your, your followers or your groups because somebody can, can benefit from the woman that's going to be on this show. Um, I, mean, I know a lot of different women, and so I want I want to share them to my followers and to my community as well. And I do see Brittany is is in the house. I know I oh let I me mean, highlight her. She's watching us from Georgetown, Kentucky. So we got Kentucky, Georgia, North Carolina, and Texas is in the house. Thank you so much, Brittany, for coming in. I greatly appreciate it, and for um, for you, Grace. And if there if there's some more watching, I can't see you. I can't see you on my on this software that I'm using, but thank you for coming in. I greatly appreciate it. Now, Dr. Tammy, mm -hmm. you now let me tell you, I was told uh, <laughs> time, <laughs> time. Oh, you were told. <laughs> I was told before to get a podcast, and I said nope. I kept throwing it off. I said I don't want a podcast, and you know I slid in your DM. And I was talking to you about podcasts because I, I I was checking out her Instagram. I've been on Dr. Tammy podcast. I've been listening to her episodes. And so, you know, those of you who don't know what a podcast is, that's just another outlet, another, that's more exposure of, of you and your brand getting out there. It's like a radio show in a, in a sense where you can listen to podcasts anywhere or at, at work in the car, in your house while you're multitasking. My podcast is amazing. I didn't I didn't realize until I started research. I said, I need to get into something more. Because different ones had come to me and they said, Veronica, you need a podcast. And I'm like, no, 
I don't. So I had to go to Dr. Tammy um, and talk to her about it because she has a podcast, um, which is absolutely amazing. Now, is is what made you want to get into podcasting? Is that like the audio version of your book? Well, okay. So podcasting was actually, I don't know. Well, let me let me back up. So I really realized when I did a TV spot that I really liked radio, TV, and film. And I, you know, and I do love broadcasting, so I was always in front of the camera, but I love radio. Like, I really, really like radio. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking, what is the closest thing to radio that I could do? And so I started podcast. And so I started podcasting. And I listened to podcasts, and I'm thinking, I can do that. I can do a podcast. So I just, I started, you know, so I said, I'm just going to start doing it and, um, and just hit the button. So of course I miss doing the most here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and so I started looking at different platforms and it took me forever to decide on the platform because I didn't want to have to switch midstream and do all that. And so once I decided on the platform, then the rest was pretty easy. Once I found out, you figured out a platform that was easy for me to use that I could use. I said, okay, I'm going to do a podcast. And I decided mm -hmm. there's a lot of people that don't watch live broadcasts because you feel like you have to watch, you have to do the comments and stuff. But podcasting, people can just listen. People can just right. listen, take in. If they want to take notes or they're in a place where they can take notes, they can. But it's, it's not a requirement. People listen to it in their car. I know I do when I'm traveling and things. And I thought, you know, I can do this. And so I decided, you know, the things that I was sharing online that I would do um, on a podcast. And so I started it last year and then I stopped. It kind of went dormant because life kind of got away. I was trying to do the playbook and other things. And then I said, you know, I'm picking this back up. This is something I'm really passionate about, something I really want to do. So it's one of my goals for 2019 to, to upload at least 40 podcasts. That means at least 40 weeks out of the year, I'm planning to do that. You know, of course, with a few breaks there, that's in my schedule. Yeah. I've built in my schedule, so about 40 weeks. And so I said, that's, so that's my goal, to upload 40, 40 podcast episodes. And so we uploaded, an, I uploaded another one, I guess, yesterday. <laughs> I think I did see the notification. So you, you 40. So you, that, that is, you know, I heard in one of your podcasts, that's a lot. That's a lot of episodes. Yeah. But, but that's good. <laughs> yeah. That's one each week. Now your, do your students listen to your podcast too? You, do you incorporate that into your lessons? I haven't yet. It says it's fairly new. It's fairly new. Um, and so this, I'm on episode nine, episode 10 will go up next week. And so it's about 10 weeks old. Um, so I I share about me being on social media and how my mm -hmm. friends, but I don't think my students understand the magnitude <laughs> or anything <laughs> all that I do. Um, they just know, okay, she's here and she makes us work. Um, <laughs> mm -hmm. So, but um, I would really love, but it does, as far as the book, what it does is talk about the, the motivation, the encouragement behind reaching those goals, those things that you've set, that you've written in there, sometimes it gets overwhelming and we get discouraged. I can't tell mm -hmm. you how many of us plan. We plan, we have a vision, and then when we see how big it is, we get overwhelmed. We see all right. the steps, oh, we yeah. get overwhelmed, and we stop. So the podcast and the things that I do online, the things that I do for encouragement and educational and strategy and that kind of thing with, through my broadcast are really to encourage you to keep going and then, of course, give you strategies on how you can tackle those things that you have written in there. And so it, it all goes hand in hand. It's just a different piece of it. Um, some mm -hmm. is actual strategy. Some is kind of the background, like just to keep going, to keep putting in the action, putting in the work. Right. And then there are some episodes where you actually interviewed yes. um, someone. So she yes. also interviews people as well yes. um, up, up there. Yes. Absolutely. So, mm -hmm. um, and I'll have people guest on, um, it's not necessarily every episode because mm -hmm. you know, I have the things that I want to share. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> some things that I want to uh, tackle. But um, that I have on my list, my goal list. But there, are, so I like to bring on influential people, men and women, 
who mm-hmm. are moving in that direction of more preparing for what's next in their life and sharing how they did, did it and sharing about their journey. And so I have some great women entrepreneurs so far that I've interviewed and that are on there that I encourage people to check out and listen to their stories because those are inspiring. Those are encouraging, um, especially when you hear someone else's journey. And I'm not one to say, if I can do it, you can do it. I don't believe in that. But what I do believe in is that if you have the right tools and strategies and you have that, that wheel, you have that drive to do it, then you can do whatever you want to do, whatever you put your mind to. And so Um, I'm hoping the podcast will encourage people that if you are set on doing something, that you go for it, that you go right. You may pause, you may take a little break, you may rest a bit, catch a breath, but you keep going. You don't stop. You don't. Right. Right. And that is, that is, that's the beauty behind your book. Um, You know, it's a playbook. It's something that if they do take a break, they can just like write and jot some things down. Now, do you offer when you do you do like offer any like like um, I know you say you have a a Facebook group. Mm -hmm. Do you have anything like support services? What if someone wants to reach out to you and say, you know, I need someone to help me with my goals or different things? Do you see clients or anything? Yes. Yeah, so I do um, have individual appointments, and individual sessions av- available. We ha- I have vision strategy sessions available. Um, and so people can always catch it. You can get, get that on my website as well. Um, you can always book me for speaking engagements. I do that as well. And um, so even smaller groups. Um, we have some a group here that does a, s- a sister circle. And I go and share with them sometimes. And so, you know, things like that. I, I have other communities that are also free that mm-hmm. you can join that support and where where you get support from other like-minded women so i have women aspiring for more which is my book club community my online reading community and it's a global community we have women from all over the world in there um this yeah. month we're just finishing up reading becoming by michelle obama and mm-hmm. um each month we read a different book and we do use live broadcasting to have our book discussions. We engage in different um, ways of discussing even outside of the group. And so that's, that's a free community and you can get to that through my website or even going to bit.ly forward slash women aspire 17. Um, I even have a fitness community. Um, so those that just want to focus on fitness and mm-hmm. make natural solutions. Cause I also um, dibble dabble. <laughs> essential oils don't so don't we all oils and, and natural solutions and so that can mm-hmm. be for those that want to just be fit and well um live healthy fit and well and so and it's a community because we, we we're real in there like it's about being real because one thing i know is that some of us are really busy and some people can really live this strict lifestyle where they can eat right way and do this and everything goes as planned for those of us that are like me it doesn't and so we talk about navigating the natural um the ways like the ways that fit your lifestyle you yes, know how to do yes. that in the midst of it all how do you do it with your current lifestyle how do you stay fit and well um you know because i know people want to say fit and well is to be skinny but i know skinny people who are way unhealthier than i am that's so, true yes you know you know, so mm-hmm. but so our thing is to be fit and well. So when you do your blood work and you go to the doctor and you can go up a flight of stairs without passing out, those type of things. So like so like that community's for that. Um, and so I have different things. Like I I I have what we call or what I would call a cocoon. I have cocoon experience. Ooh. So I have smaller communities that support you in different ways. Whether you want professional and personal self development in the reading mm-hmm. community. Fitness and then of course travel. Ah, uh, yeah. Playbook. You can plan your 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 trips. It has a tracker for you to plan your trips and what you want to save for your trips. Mm-hmm. And so, um, I have a travel community, and that travel community we are we aspire to explore more and to travel and see the world and get exposure to other cultures and stuff. So there's support. The way I have it set up, there's support for you in the different areas of your life. You can get it individually or you can go into the membership group and get it all in one in one community. So it just depends on what you're looking for. So definitely reach out to me. You can inbox me and I can definitely share with you more information on how to connect and um, make it happen for yourself. 
And that is, I'm trying to put it on the screen. I hope there's no um, technical issues or glitches, but on the screen, that is Dr. Tammy's website. Um, that's what I saw. That's what she has listed, um, especially on her Instagram. That's her, um, you go to Linktree, she has a lot of um, links that connects to basically everything that, that she does. As you can see, she's busy. She's a busy woman, but but it's good busy. <laughs> it's good. Now, you mentioned travel. Yes. I I saw a cruise. Yes. So that, <laughs> is, that is our first trip. So the so my community, I've invited my community. I'm inviting all of you if you want to come. Um, we're going on a cruise in May, and it's it's really my birthday cruise. <laughs> uh -huh. But it's also a cruise for um, our community. But we leave on my birthday. We leave May 18th. That is my birthday. And so mm -hmm. and we're going on a seven-day cruise. We're going to Belize, Cozumel, Grand Cayman, um, Mahogany Bay, Roatan. And we're, we're going to all these places. And so we're going to have fun. And so each year, we'll take a trip. There'll be a cruise each year, one cruise, and then we'll take an additional trip to somewhere else, which may be domestic or international. Um, it just depends mm -hmm. on the trip. And then, of course, in that community, we also... I. I go around to different places and we connect and have meetups um, around. So like there'll be a meetup in Atlanta um, next month at early next month. And then there'll probably be a meetup when I go to DC and there'll be a meetup, you know, so there's meetups when I go to right. Miami, Florida. So there's, there's, there'll be meetups at different places. So in that group, you can, you know, if you go to my links, you can find me, you can mm -hmm. see when I'm in your city. Now, Dr. Tammy, have you ever thought about doing a book tour? Yes. <laughs> you see, I that want I want point. everyone to get to really know, you know, what the, these women I told you, these if you get around certain type of women, certain type of people, they will push you and they will change <laughs> change your whole perspective. Tell us about if you you got any book tour in works. So that's what I plan to do. So it's it's really um, that's that's basically what I want to do <laughs> and what I plan to do um, mm -hmm. when I go to the different cities is um, I'll have book. I'll have my book. So with the meetups are typically I give some sort of session. They're a little different than just like, hey, girl, hey. Um, <laughs> mm -hmm. Usually there's some I offer a workshop and or a group session and that's going to be around the book. And uh, of course, in book signing, I'll do all that. And then, of course, we'll do, we'll usually do dinner or something afterwards. So each city is a little different. I have an ambassador program, a brand ambassador program, Catalyst for Change brand ambassadors um, in different cities. And those are the local people on the ground that make sure we get a good venue, good place to eat that accommodates us. And so we do it that way. And so it's a book tour, but it's a little more informal. It's more like my style. You know, it's yeah. not this yeah. type event. Um, maybe in the future we'll get to that point. But right now it's just me meeting up with the ladies in my community. Most of them want to meet me face to face and want to connect face to face. Like most of us do and hug each other's neck and just show each other some love. And so I want that mm -hmm. opportunity. But then I also share some of the things that they don't get um, by me being online because, you know, a lot of what I share in those groups and when we have those sessions are things that I would share in my membership group or for my mm -hmm. paid clients. And so, and then we go to dinner because, you know, I like to eat. So we usually go to dinner or lunch, depending on the time of day that um, we've arranged. And we, we just hang out and take pictures and laugh and do our thing. And so that's typically what I do. And so when I go to different cities, that's what I do. Um, and so that's why I say, if you want to connect with me, just let me know as I'll probably be in your city. I have several of them lined up already. Um, and the reason I said earlier that I hope to do is because I hope to add more to my list. Um, but I do have some in my list. Like I called out a few of them um, already. And so, yeah. 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 You, you got a full plate. Yeah. And so you know about time management and you, and plus you're a mom. This is educator. my thing. So, so, okay, Veronica, so can I be transparent? Can I have a transparent? Yes, yes. So this is the one that I show you all because it's the mm -hmm. clean. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one that's all beat up with all my tags and flags <laughs> <laughs> that I use that has all my stuff written in and everything. This is the one that I, I work with. So when I on camera, I showed the pretty one. But in yeah, reality, yeah. I use mine because I, I like for people to use it at night and in the mm -hmm. morning. 
You know, mm -hmm. at night you should say, okay, what did I accomplish today? What did I do? What do I want to accomplish tomorrow? Then in the morning, okay, this is what I put on my list. Let me tackle it. Because like I say, when you see it written, even though you don't look at it again, it's in the back of your brain. So you tend to accomplish it. And so I use mine, girlfriend. I use it like nothing else. I use yes. it. It's all beat up. It's everything. But it, it's holding strong and hanging on. <laughs> mm -hmm. And that's Dr. Tammy's book I put on the screen for those who are interested. You want to see. I hope they can kind of see because it looks a little different on my end. So I hope everyone can see it. And But you know what, Dr. Tammy, you have to be the first partaker because you of, of, what, of whatever it is that you're doing, uh, because you're selling, you know, you're selling that book and you and you just showed us how much you use it. It's, I know. I just and, to show the cover. It's all beat up. And, um, <laughs> it's all written in. It has my collage. Oh, man. My membership group gets the raw, but I try to be all professional on here with you. <laughs> I got to be sophisticated. This is, <laughs> this is girl talk. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. But I appreciate that. I'm so glad that you came on the show. I'm glad everyone, that those who's watching live, thank you. And those who watch the replay, thank you for watching the replay. Post your questions with city and state that you're watching us from. And if, if anyone have any questions, please post it in the comment. I believe my mom mentioned that she would wanted to get your book. Um, I think she she mentioned that um, within the in her comments. So that you see is what I mean, Doctor Tammy. <laughs> So I guess I should tell your mom what she's going to get. So I know I've been saying planner and all these stuff that it replaces, but I guess to really get down to the meat of the book so you can decide if it's something that fits you is that it has at the beginning the year in review. And it has you think about what did you accomplish last year so that way you can decide what you want to build on or continue for this year. It has a calendar that's 18 months. So whether you're a teacher, you want to do lesson plans, you want to uh, you want to do a marketing calendar, you're an entrepreneur, you want to do what your mar marketing and launching for the year, or you just like mm -hmm. the year at a glance. That's what it is at the beginning. And you can tailor it to your lifestyle. I even have journal pages. I always carry a journal and I'm thinking, why am I carrying all these books? So there's journal pages and there are a lot of journal pages. So you can just keep your what your thoughts, as she said, like even when you take a little break or rest, you can keep your thoughts in there. At the end of the day, you can keep your thoughts. It has travel trackers where you can track your trip and what you save. It has things for finances. Um, your monthly budget, as well as what you want to manifest and what you want to bring. So if you want $3,000 each month, you can put that in the tracker. And then you can also, is there's places for you to generate how you're going to get that $3,000, right? Oh. You can do it. And so it's really cool in that sense. It has, even for those of us that are focusing on fitness, it has a meal planning calendar. It has um, water tracker, so you can track your water because water is really big, and your exercise and fitness. And so you can even track that in there. It has places um, in here where you can even do um, your daily to do. And so I, so it's set up in a, a yearly. You can do that yearly, and then by mm -hmm. each quarter, and then with each quarter, it has monthly, weekly and daily. And so it really breaks it down because a lot of us get overwhelmed when we see all that we have to do, but you really should break oh, yeah. it down. To what am I doing today? And so that's what it really guides you to do. So when, when you're working with me and we going through it, I kind of show you how that works. But if you pick it up on your own, just notice that, just remember I said that, that it really is annually at the front and then it has the years. So you can always go back and you can do your vision. And our vision is constantly evolving. So it has places in there for it to evolve where you don't have to have one vision board. No, there's a vision mm -hmm. collage for the year. There's a vision collage for each quarter and each month. And that way you can actually, you can, whatever your vision is for that moment and you can go with it. And, you know, it even has, it even has strategies in there on how to write affirmations and how to create affirmations for your life. And so all those things, so faith, family, fitness, finances, and fun, travel. <laughs> yeah. And then all of that. it even have a section you said for like, if you want to do um, for finance yes. for like budgeting. Yes. So it's basic budgeting. So it's basically like a monthly budget. 
what that should look like, kind of the 80-20 rule, 80% of your living expenses and then 10% causes tithing, whatever you believe, and then 10% saving for yourself. You have to pay yourself. And so mm -hmm. it has that broken down. And then it has ways that you can, you know, places for you to keep track of that. In addition to if you need more money into your life. So some of us think we're entrepreneurs. I'm an entrepreneur. And I'm thinking, what do I need to generate in my business each month? And then it gives you a tracker where you can kind of keep track. Most of us, we think, oh, I need an extra $1,500. But we don't, we think we never got it. But really, if you track it, you can see how you got that money you wanted. So the thing is, a lot of it is all about mindset. What do you desire? Right. And so if you're getting that $1,500, but you really would like 3000 why are you not dreaming bigger? Why are you not thinking bigger? You should think bigger. And so right. it also gets you to see that because a lot of people think, well, I'm not getting it. I'm not getting it. No, you got it. But apparently it wasn't what you really wanted. And so we got to really address some of those things. So it's really good to write all that down. So it has places for all of those things in there. And so, yes, it has finances. The finance section will be, you know, I um, already have revisions for the finance section for the book for the 2020 edition because every mm -hmm. year... I'll update it and revise it according to what's the new trends and what's going on, the new the new changes in um, lifestyle that we have. But yeah, it's in there. Yeah, it sounds like that. That's a lifestyle book. Yes, basically, it's a lifestyle because you you that's why I now see why you call it the playbook because I wanted you to kind of break it down. Yes. Some, a lot of people are not not um, familiar with playbooks. They're not familiar with with certain things. Yes. So, you know, being who you are, I know you, you're going to break it down. <laughs> yeah, and <laughs> so, so, you it, have it. so that's a good question. I apologize, but I didn't make that clear. So it's called the playbook because just like in football, they have plays on how to win the game. This is how you're going to win in life, whether right. it's life or business. And these are the right. plays and strategies to help you win in life. And it's templates. It's basically templates and methods and strategies for how to do that. Hi, Janice. How are you? Thank you for joining us. Hey. And, um, and so, so it's really like a darling. <laughs> yeah, I know. She's a, that that's she's that and that's all the way. She don't even have to put her state in. That's just, she's coming all the way from New York City. <laughs> is it is it Queens, Janice? She's either Queens or Brooklyn. It's one of them. But that, that's that's darling right there. <laughs> Thank you for joining, honey. Make sure you share this, this broadcast out. Oh, I'm sorry, Dr. Tammy. You no, go ahead. You... I was, that was all I was saying. I was just saying that's why it's called a playbook. Because these are strategies, tactics, methods. These are just lifestyle strategies. And they're templates to help guide you through that process. And that way you can win in life. Mm. Yeah. It sounds like a good book. That's why it's that's why it, her book is so thick because it's a it's all in it's one. lifestyle. She you you basically thought of something to cover everything. So this is not just this is not for women. Yes. This is catered for anybody. Exactly. It doesn't matter what um whether you're a college, you're a student mm -hmm. or not or if you um going back to school, it doesn't matter what age group you fit in. Dr. Tammy developed a book that will fit anybody. Basically. Oh, Veronica, you said it. You said it's not just for women. You're right. Um, and I know this the, the show is for women. So women, it's definitely for you because you know I had you in mind, girlfriend. When, when I <laughs> But when I decided on the design of the book, just to go through the design of the book, I was really mm -hmm. about it not being too frou frou. <laughs> That's not a word. Yeah. But to, yeah. to, to, I wanted it to be very clean and basic and just 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 the strategies were there because I wanted one, I wanted even guys, men to pick it up and use it. And then mm -hmm. I knew as women, we like to add stickers and our markers, we color code it. Yeah. Like you saw me, we I highlight my, <laughs> little, my little fancy, my little fancy little bookmarks that I use. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, I, I add all those in there. So I knew people can customize it and make it, according to their lifestyle, according to what your liking is and your personality. And so that's that's another thing about it. So when you get it, it's not going to be all fancy with squirrelies and squigglies because that was intentional. Because I didn't mm -hmm. want, I wanted you to be able to customize it to your liking. Mm -hmm. That's good. And so I see why you, you didn't make it, um, make the cover so like girly. Yes. Because you were trying to reach, you know, other, the males, the men as well. Yes. Well, thank Whoever you. Get your life, get it. Yes. 
Yes. Yes. In the words of Taylor, get your life. <laughs> yes. It's because it's it's just it's just time. It's just time to it. It's just time to step out the box. And just my my thing, you know, my one word I said, y'all, was evolution. Mm -hmm. Before 2019 came in, Dr. Tamara know we had a pass to cast. And I said my one word for 2019. I was in the, I was like in 20, 2018 after all that shifting and turning. And I think that's when you announced your book and I was listening to everyone. I said, you know what? I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm ready now to step out and do the doggone thing. But my main word is, is evolution is changed. So everything that I've been through, sometimes we, for, for me to be transparent, a lot of times we do things more behind the scenes than when we're home and that nobody else can see. So people have no idea the gifts and the ability that's inside of you. For an example, like Dr. Tammy, she wrote this book. She has this podcast. She She's just coming out. And she, she gave, basically you laid out everything that you're doing from your, your group, from your cruise, you, I mean, you just, the fit, you're doing everything. If you didn't do what you did, we wouldn't know who Dr. Tammy is. You know, we just know that, oh, you have a doctor, either you are a medical doctor or, you know, you're educated. <laughs> yeah, what do you do? <laughs> yeah, but there's more to the woman. It's more to your name than, than what it is. So it's always good to, to whatever you, that's why I said this show is all about women who are using their God-given gifts. These are, this, this is Dr. Tammy's gifts that she was talking to us about. And let me touch on, if anyone, any of you have any questions for Dr. Tammy, um, you feel free to comment. Now, if you want to connect with her after the show, I know she will love that. I know Dr. Tammy, don't mind, she will love that. And Janice said, she said she saw the book and had to come in here. Lord, Janice, Janice is a blogger, y'all. Yeah. She, she is a blogger. She's a writer. So, you know, Janice loves to read. So when she sees a book, she gets to running. <laughs> <laughs> she gets to running. And so Janice, now this mm -hmm. one you probably don't want to read, but it's going to help you plan what you're reading. Because it is there is pages in there for you to put a list of the books you want that's on your your wish list um but mm -hmm. also i have i have some other books coming this year i have about four that's going to be out this year that um that you're going to actually read and so be, stay, stay tuned They'll be i out didn't soon. know that i didn't hear that i didn't hear that in the past the cast but the per <laughs> so she just I'm dropped something right now. yeah right so y'all need to save her website link Save a link. That I know she's going to have more links to her books. And Grace yeah. mentioned, if I highlight her comment, she says she's going to check you out. Check it out as soon as we get off this board. <laughs> so thank yeah. you. I, I am so glad to see those who are coming in and, and watching us live and watching the replay. I'm glad to see that you ladies are enjoying this and that it's interesting to you. I greatly appreciate all the support. Even I love even the replay viewers. Thank you. Thank you for watching me and Tammy, Dr. Tammy, appreciate it so much. Now, do you have any other, um, any other thing you want to let us know, let, let the community know of what you, any events or speaking events you have coming up? So I, I do have some, but just follow me. I haven't announced them. They'll be announced okay. very soon. Like I say, Atlanta's coming up, but definitely follow me on social media. That's the best way to keep in touch. I'm at Dr. Tammy Francis everywhere. And if you even want to see like glimpses of the inside of the book, which I don't really put out there much anywhere except right. the membership group, but on my Instagram, there's a sneak peek. If you look in the photos, I have a little sneak mm -hmm. peek. But so if you follow me on social media, you'll get wind of everything that I'm doing and you'll see what's going on. Also on my website, I have a press and media page. If there's anything coming up, I'll usually update that. Um, I'll update it for February. It's a little outdated right now, but February, usually the beginning of the month, I update it. And so you'll get to see events that way too if you're not necessarily on other platforms or you miss it on here. You can definitely always go to my website and see where I am and connect with me. Okay. All right. Thank you, Dr. Tammy Francis. Don I want to just say Dr. Tammy Francis, but it's Donaldson <laughs> at the that's end. It. You can Francis. There you go. <laughs> that's my handle and that's, that, that's my social media presence. So you're fine with that. Okay. All right. Well, thank you so much for coming on the Lady Ball Show. I and, and you know what, everyone, this is like this is the last day of January to let you know we are, I'm completely, I believe, completely booked with ladies for the month of February. 
So the next guest that we're going to be having, and I hope everyone, you guys, you know, continue to view and check it out. And, you know, you could slide in my DM if there's anything particular that you would like to see that, you know, any, you know, let, let me know. And when you see me post the graphics as far as who I'm going to be speaking, if you want to send any questions for me to ask them, you can do that as well. But to mess, to, so the next time, that will be what, February 7th? Well, the, the following, that next week, Thursday, I believe. I got to double check. Um, the, I'm going to be interviewing a Lachey. We know her, the lovely photog. <laughs> She's a member of the per Perry Girls group. She is a photographer. We're going all the way to Arkansas. We're going all the way to Arkansas. Dr. Tammy know a lot of you, a lot of the ladies in Perry Girls. We know her, if because I know her, her daughter has um, been sick. So if everything is okay, we're going to be interviewing Lachey Brewer. She's going to be coming on, and she has a story to tell too, because she she's doing her thing. She's a blogger as well, and she's doing her thing. But thank you everyone for watching the Lady Boss Show. Hope to see you guys next week, and thank you, Dr. Tammy, for coming on exactly. Lady Boss Show. I got to have you again when them four books drop. You know I'm gonna have you back up here, right? All right, perfect. Because you know I got to have because when the when the ladies do something new, and when they be in events, I got to circle back around. All right. <laughs> Perfect. We can do an anniversary edition. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. And Grace, before we go, Grace said, she said she will be on that. Okay. I love Grace. Grace is Grace. a, she, Grace probably be on the show too, y'all, because Grace is a jewel. I would love to introduce everyone to Grace okay. and Janice. All Janice says she loves Lachey. Yeah. I'm going to introduce Lachey to everyone, to my, to my audience, to my community. And yeah, thank you, Grace. And that's another one I want to highlight before we go. Oh, and my mom said, thank you, Dr. Tammy. She enjoyed listening to you. And so she probably connecting with you too, as far as your book, because she's interested in your book. <laughs> well, thank you everyone for watching the Lady Ball Show. I hope to see you guys next week. Bye.